Hey guys, Zebra here playing the Halo Reach beta and yeah, not Modern Warfare 2 or Splinter Cell. Uh, I know, I hope you can, uh, hope you can deal with change. <laughs> um, I'm hopefully going to get a few more videos up and this is a montage video because I uh, just thought get some uh, single clips that uh, I thought were good from various games and uh, just for the first video so you can see uh, a nice variation of what this game's all about. So to begin, I guess uh, one of the major new points is the fact you can assassinate people now. So if you're um, if you're coming up behind someone, um, you can melee them as normal and just put them to the floor, <laughs> um, or you can hold down the uh, the melee button and it will uh, do like a, a finishing move, a nice flashy finishing move. But you can be killed when that's happening. So it's uh, you know best do it when you know you're one on one or something, because otherwise uh, the rest of the team will probably deck you for doing it. Um, so. Uh, other new things are loadouts. I was interested to see what Bungie were going to do with these because, uh, or with the whole game, in fact, because obviously people have become very familiar and very fond of Modern Warfare 2. I wanted to uh, see if uh, Bungie were going to, you know, introduce loadouts, introduce kill streaks, maybe, and perks and stuff. But uh, it's at, at the base of it all. It's still very much Halo. They haven't really, um, you know, they haven't really taken too many. Uh, Lessons from Modern Warfare, it still takes uh, 100 bullets to kill someone, it still takes like two melees to, punt to kill someone, unlike uh, Commando where you can kill everyone from 500 feet across the map with Commando. Um, so um, they have kind of copied the loadouts, but it's a bit more like Battlefield I'd say, you uh, in the beta at least, I don't know if it will change in the final game, but in the beta you have four classes that you can choose from so to speak, you've got the Scout who can sprint, which is the one I use most, a guy who can... Um, it's like a guardian, he uh, creates a barrier around him and he's invulnerable to uh, hits when he's like that. That's uh, like bu having a bubble shield, basically. Oh. Got a guy who can go invisible, who I was just chasing there. Um, and he scrambles your radar when he's near you, invisible. And um, then you have a jetpack person, which is self-explanatory, I guess. They can uh, jetpack around the place and cause havoc from the skies. Um, I like to use a scout. I like to uh, run up behind people and assassinate them, or uh, you know, run away from uh, the heat of battle if uh, I start getting shot by about ten different people, which happens often. <laughs> happens a bit too much. Um, so there's a few new weapons as well. Um, you got an improved pistol. It's more like Halo One and Two kind of pistol where it zooms in. Um, the battle rifle isn't three shots anymore. It's single shot, a bit like the Fal. Um, I like that. I like the both Spartan and Elite equivalents of that. Um, and uh, I guess the uh, the new kind of weapons are grenade launchers on both sides. The Elite one you can charge up and fire numerous grenades, like um, I guess I think it's Unreal Tournament. And the Spartan one is just like a normal grenade launcher. Um, they they wreak quite a bit of havoc. Um, apart from that, you know, you got your swords, you got all the usual weapons. Uh, you got your assault rifles, alien pistols, alien assault rifles. Um, you, I'm going to get lots more videos up, so you'll see me using uh, more variations of all these weapons. Um, as for game types, you know, you've got Juggernaut, you've got Headhunter, which is interesting. Every time you get a kill, you have to, uh, you can pick up a skull, um, and you have to deposit that at uh, like a checkpoint. And if you kill someone on the way to a checkpoint, say they've got like three skulls, you can you can steal their skulls and, um, um, and you know, and deposit all their skulls as well. Um, so I really like Headhunter. I think that's good. It's kind of uh, puts an objective into free for all whilst not making me go capture a flag and try to take it back. I'm not really an objective type man. Um, and you've got uh, Juggernauts, which is insane on the beta. The Juggernauts are invulnerable. They just they cannot kill them. I swear. Like, uh, I was hitting my mate Johnny Rockhard there with about three hits, um, at least one to the back, and uh, he just shrugged it off and killed me. Um, and then another one is Covenant Slayer, where you all play as elites. Um, that's quite interesting. The Covenant in this, in the beta at least, don't have loadouts like the Spartans. Everyone just has a barrel roll kind of thing that they can do. You can use that twice before it has to recharge. Um, and the closest thing it is is to a scout, I guess. Um, so yeah, I will be. Uh, I think we're coming to the end of the video now. <laughs> I'll run out of clips. I've, uh, I think I covered all the basics. You know, the new uh, new map types, new weapons, the loadouts. Um, so I hope you enjoyed the video. Please uh, subscribe so you get updates on what uh, on new videos. I've got I'll be uploading some tomorrow and obviously the following days. Hopefully, um, there'll be full games with proper commentaries. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. Please uh, comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.